going to be collecting some OSL samples of the wasp nest and I'm targeting nests that are over the art. And this is a relative dating technique that we're using because you can't really date rock art in itself because it's inorganic. So the wasp nest, um, in this instance, we're gonna try OSL, optically stimulated luminescence. So we've got a, a, a handprint here. It's a right hand with some red paint. This dark stuff I think is just natural part of the rock. And we've got a big uh, nest on top of it. Um, so I'm going to try and cut around the sides of it and then pop it out and wrap it up in foil um, so that it'll be light proof and then we can hopefully do OSL on it and then we can get a date. It's one of the ways that we can date rock art that's a little bit easier because the, the, we will isolate a quartz grain um, out of the mud that the wasps use to build their nests. A blackout blanket is wrapped around me to create lightproof conditions while I collect the OSL sample. And I have a red light head torch to illuminate the area where I'm working. So I've got a label on the bottom which tells me which side is the face. I'm gonna put it in here with a bunch of paper towels so that it doesn't roll around and get smashed up. 